Welcome, my friend. The practice I'm sharing with you today invites you to celebrate the spring equinox, welcoming change, growth, revitalization, and renewal for yourself. This practice will invite you to come out of hibernation from the winter months, clear out the cobwebs, enjoy the sense of awakening and activating the dormant energy. This class is a shortened version of the full-length class in our membership site. Feel free to hop over to access the full class as we do have a free 14-day trial. During your free trial, you could also check out our spring kit that integrates yoga, meditation, and journaling. So we do a spring cleaning to let go of old habits and plant new seeds of intention. Spring is one of the most palpable times of change. This is also available for purchase outside of the membership. I'll include the link for both below. All right, my friend, it's time to awaken and shine your light, welcoming spring with arms and heart wide open. I'll meet you seated on the mat. We'll begin our practice together with a reclining yin posture. So make your way to lying on your back for reclining butterfly pose. Bring soles of feet to kiss and knees open wide. Place one hand to your belly and one hand to your heart. Breathe deeply into your belly. Full deep inhalations through your nose, feeling your belly expand on the inhale and fall on the exhale. And we're beginning our practice with a yin pose with hands to belly and heart, keeping our attention inward as a representation of our hibernation in the winter months. So enjoy these final moments here before we slowly begin to awaken. Release your arms to your side, palms face up towards the sky, showing we are being receptive and open, our first stages of awakening. Now bring both hands to your legs to help lift them up to center. Then draw one knee into your chest and then the other and hug it out. Release and roll over to the right side. And then we'll slowly press up. Making our way to the back of the mat for a wide knees child's pose. Bringing your big toes to kiss and your knees open as wide as you would like. Then melting your torso through center, letting your forehead rest to the earth. Soften throughout your shoulders and return to your deep breathing. 
Feeling your inhalations travel the length of your spine into the space of your low back. And on your exhalations, allowing your body to weigh even heavier, settling deeper and deeper into the pose. We'll begin to awaken our body from here and clear out the cobwebs by inviting in slow, steady movement. So we are truly tuning in deeply to yourself and enjoying this sense of awakening. Let's begin by clearing out the cobwebs in our side body. So walk your palms to the left side of the mat, stacking your right palm on top of the left to deepen the stretch. Check in and make sure both sits bones are grounded. And then we'll slowly walk it through center over to the right side. Both sits bones anchored. And let your chest yearn towards the mat. And let's walk it back to center. From here, bring your knees into about hip width apart, setting up for our first awakening flow. With fingertips spread nice and wide, pressing into the mat, slowly wave your spine forward as though you're coming into cat pose. But I want you to wave it through and lower your hips and lift your heart into a variation of up dog with your legs to the mat. Beautiful. Now slowly and intentionally press your hips back to child's pose. We'll take this flow from child's pose to up dog two more times, really enjoying the sensations in your body each step of the way. Now slowly round forward, then lower your hips and lift your heart to up dog variation. Soft smile on your face. On your exhalation, hips back to child's pose. Deep breath in, in child's pose. And exhale, round forward. Inhalation as you lift up, top dog. Exhalation, hips to heels. And slowly walk yourself up. Sit up nice and tall. Gently close your eyes. Take a moment to check in. See how you're feeling feeling the warmth and awakening you have created so far. We'll take our next awakening flow moving from the ground up. So bring your fingertips behind you pointing towards your body and lift up through your chest, arching your back. From here, we'll sweep your fingertips down, forward and up, and then reach them back in space, taking it into a back bend. Press your hip points forward, and slowly begin to cactus your arms as you lower them and release into child's pose. We'll take that same feel-good flow two more times. So breathe in as you rise up, bring your fingertips behind you. Exhale as your heart shines and gaze lifts. Inhale, sweep your fingertips forward and up, and exhale as you take them back in space into a back bend. Breathe in here, hip points press the space in front of you. Then exhale as you slowly cactus your arm, lowering them down into child's pose. One more round, my friend. Fingertips behind you, shoulder blades squeeze in towards your spine, lift up in your chest. Sweep your fingertips forward, up and back, heart radiating, coming to light. Cactus your arms 
and this time lower your hips to heels and sit up nice and tall. Hands rest to your thighs and close your eyes. Taking another moment to tune deeply into yourself and enjoying the sense of awakening in your body, this revitalization. Let's take a few more side body stretches. That is one area I always feel could use a little extra clearing out. Lower your left hand to the mat as the opposite reaches up and over. Slowly sweep your top arm down, taking it into a twist over to the right. And we'll breathe and lift up to center. Exhale, right arm lowers to the mat. Opposite fingertips reach up and over. Sweep your top arm down, take it into a twist to the left. Breathe in, lift back up to center, and circle your arms down. Bring your hands to your knees, and begin to draw big circles with your torso. Just warming up our spine here. Allow your head and neck to flow with the movement. Switch directions of your circles. We're inhaling as you circle forward, and exhaling as you circle back. Beautiful, my friend. Return to center, lengthen up through your spine, taking a moment once more to tune in with yourself, with your body, and your awakening and renewal into the spring. Like seedlings in the springtime reaching up to the sun, we'll be taking our next steps of growth by moving to a standing flow. So walk your palms forward and press your hips to down dog. Take a moment of intuitive movement here, taking any feel-good moves, clearing out the cobwebs. And let's awaken your core strength by lifting to your tiptoes and then mindfully ripple your spine forward coming into plank pose. Pause for a moment before you lift up through your pelvic floor taking your hips to down dog. Good work. Go ahead and take this three to four more times moving at your own intuitive pace, engaging your personal power center. Last one, I'll meet you in down dog. All right, friend, glance forward and step one foot to the front of the mat and then the other for our forward fold. On your next inhalation, lift a flat back, your crown of head reaching forward. Exhale, soften and melt chest to thighs. Circle your fingertips down around and up, your palms kiss and lower prayer to heart. Bring your thumbs to kiss your sternum while your sternum reaches up. Soft smile on your face. We'll be taking three half sun salutations next. For my YouTube yogis, this will be our final flow in welcoming the spring awakening. Let's simply focus on enjoying our breath, connecting our breath with the movement, 
and how this feels in our body, that prana flowing through you. Let's begin. Inhalation, circle your fingertips to the sky, your palms kiss. Exhalation, reach back, take it into a back bend before you dive it down through center. We'll breathe in, lift halfway. Breathe out, soften and release. Inhalation, circle fingertips down around and up. Palms kiss the top and exhale, lower prayer to heart. Inhalation, circle fingertips to the sky. Exhale, reach back, then dive it down through center. We're breathing, lift halfway. Exhale, meld forward. Inhalation, circling fingertips down around and up. Palms kiss, exhale, lower prayer to heart center. Breathe in, fingertips circle up. Palms kiss, exhale, reach back and dive it down. Inhale, lift flat back, lengthening your spine. Exhale, soften and round forward. Inhalation, circle fingertips to the sky. Your palms kiss. Exhale, lower prayer to heart. Bringing your thumbs to kiss the sternum once more. The sternum lifts up to your thumbs. Take a deep inhalation through your nose, filling your body up. And a long, slow exhalation out your nose. Circle your fingertips to the sky, gathering love and light. Your palms kiss, bring all that love and light down to heart center. Thumbs kissing your sternum once more, sealing that love and light in. With hands at your heart center, grounding down in all four corners of your feet. Take a moment here to think about what you want the spring season to bring for you. My YouTube friends, this is where I'll leave you. If you'd like to complete the full class with me, visit link below to the membership site. I hope to see you there, but if not, I encourage you to take a moment to journal after this class. Jot down what came to mind as to what you want the spring season to bring for you. Then write down two to three intentions to help you get there. Make sure they are in the present tense and contain positive language. The spring kit I created can also assist you with this, and that's linked below too. Thank you so much for practicing with me. I hope you feel a sense of awakening from the winter months, and you are ready to burst into life and spring into the season with your arms and heart wide open. So much love to you, from my heart to yours. Namaste.